Welcome back everybody. In this video we're going to learn a little bit more about vectors. When we consider vectors in pairs, uh, they can be any of the three following types. They can be either parallel, equivalent, or opposite. Uh, parallel vectors have the same or opposite direction, but not necessarily the same magnitude. So if you consider the diagram on your left, um, vector AB is parallel to vector CD. Equivalent vectors have the same magnitude and the same direction. However, the location of the vectors uh, does not matter. So if you uh, consider the diagram on your right, uh, vector PQ is equivalent to vector RS. And similarly, vector um, QS is equivalent to vector PR. Now, opposite vectors have the same magnitude but opposite direction. Again, the location of the vectors does not matter. So if you consider the following two vectors, if you consider um, these two vectors, and let's give them some direction. So uh, let's call the first vector um, n, m, and the second one s, p. Now uh, n, m, as you can tell, um, is facing the northeast direction, and s, p is facing the uh, southwest direction. So in this case, n, m, so the vectors n, m, and p, s are opposite. So mathematically, you can write them as such, you can write them as <clears throat> nm. Let's write that a better. So n nm is opposite to sp, or, or I apologize, ps. Now I know this doesn't make a lot of sense right now, but uh, we're gonna uh, we're gonna explore this this. Uh, negative sign here a bit more in the, in the coming videos, uh, but essentially what it means is that we're now considering um, uh, PS, but once you add the negative sign there, you can almost think of them as switching their endpoints. So PS becomes SP, and SP is equivalent to NM. Now that's just one way of thinking about it, but once again, folks, I don't want to confuse you in this video, and we're going to explore the same, um, you know, the same avenue uh, in, in more depth at later videos. So uh, once again, this is all you have to know about parallel, equivalent, and opposite vectors. I, uh, I hope you learned something from this video, and please let me know how I'm doing. Thank you.